my first YouTube vlog ever. And I came over for coffee and breakfast at Mitchell's house. But I'm all, all ready to run. Um, this is my first YouTube video ever since uh, seventh grade or something when I made a Spanish class video making uh, some sort of rice and I had to speak in Spanish. So if it sucks, oh well. But here we go, day of my life. Mochi, hello. Oh, freaking the light from my watch keeps like going on the wall and she's going insane for it. All right, some oats with peanut butter and honey, and don't look at that. And then coffee with some oat milk and water. And Mitchell's reading his book. Bowerman, no, Ringmaster. <laughs> Vince McMahon in the Unmaking of America. Okay, because he, he just read Bowerman something book. So um, now he's on to his next book. There, in case anyone wants to read it, um, yay. We are headed to practice, but first, gotta scrape the ice. Even though I can wear shorts on this run, it was super cold overnight, so. Here we go, that's the bubble. Heading on into the bubble, our indoor track. All right, it's Wednesday, so we're probably gonna have like a moderate long run, but it's also race week, so maybe it'll be less. Here we go, here we go. Here we are. Here's everybody. Really, a lot of people today, but 75 minutes. So we're halfway, halfway break. This is Coach Duncan. <laughs> we are not halfway. Actually, we're very far from it, but we're taking a break anyway. Good Amelia Earhart. Here's a statue. First woman aviator in memory. So all right, they're run all done. Let's go. I did the Spanish class and the Spanish class and the Spanish class and the Spanish class and the Spanish Nine miles at 8.15 pace, nice kind of recovery. My legs feel awful, I'm so sore, but. Alrighty, I'm home from practice. I changed into comfy clothes um, and gonna drink some water. I'm gonna have avocado toast, a smoothie, and a hot oat milk latte, duh. Um, and then I think I'm gonna take an Epsom salt bath because my legs felt like booty on that run. Oh yeah, here's the toast eggs, smoothie, water, whiskey. All right, here's the spread. Eggs, toast, avocado, seasonings, hot, hot oat milk latte, smoothie, electrolytes. And high key, I think my smoothie maker blender is broken. It started exploding smoothie all over the place. Um, so this little amount of smoothie is really took a lot of effort. Um, I also struggle every single time to get the this off of the actual blender bottom part. Um, so I think maybe the blender is starting to die. Like here's the crime scene. I cleaned it halfway up. It actually splattered all over here and on this. Yay, happy breakfast. All right, I'm making an Epsom salt bath because I'm so sore. Um, and I'm just gonna sit in it for like 20 minutes to help me recover from my workout yesterday and from my run today, so. And this is my lifeguard. He's gonna make sure I don't drown in the bathtub. So I really appreciate his help. You have anything to say? Okay. Yay for Epsom salt bath recovery. All right, I'm having a slice of banana bread and I'm taking whiskey, whiskey, to go get a Kitty Chino at the coffee shop. So, all right, here we are. He's back there, his carrier. Um, it's almost his birthday, so that's why we're getting him a pop cup. Also, preface, I am on spring break right now. That's why my day is like low-key super relaxed and chill and I'm not doing like class or anything because I'm on spring break. So um, that's why I don't have school. There he is eating his pop cup and here's his sister while well, she was just eating hers. This is Mochi, so Mitchell's cat. Yummy, yummy. Yummy, yummy, yummy. Now I'm just gonna do some computer work, homework, um, work stuff. So catch you when I do something interesting again. I'm going to my teammate slash friend's house to paint my nails now because I feel like painting my nails. Here's the nail kit set up and here's my friend's dog. Um, 
Yeah, so, and here's Arnold. I used to live with Arnold, so, okay. I'm painting my nails this color. And Pepper's getting brushed by Emily. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I finished my nails. Um, I'm not a nail artist, but they're done. And now I'm gonna eat some jelly beans from my friends. There's Emily. We're, we're watching The Bachelor. I'm pretty invested now. I've never seen it before and we're on the second to last episode. So I'm joining late, but anyway. Here we go, we're watching The Bachelor. It's getting pretty heated. Morgan just came back from her run and I keep getting my hand in the way of the camera and the dog's sleeping and Emily is sitting there. <laughs> All right, did my nails, watched some Bachelor, ate some jelly beans. Now I'm gonna go home and make dinner. I'm gonna make nachos for dinner because I have nacho supplies, so. First, I will feed Whiskey, who knows exactly where his food is, don't you, buddy? Din? Din? All right, here's the dinner setup. Salsa, black beans, and then this is like cut up vegetables, avocado, the chips. And then don't judge me, but for protein, I'm going to have some sardines because I actually really like sardines, um, specifically the ones in tomato sauce. So, kind of low-key a lazy dinner, but... That is best. I'm heating the nachos up in there and then I'm gonna chow down. But, bro, earlier, freaking guy, a random guy, pulled up to our my apartment, our apartment, um, and freaking shimmied the door handle. I think he just had the wrong apartment, but still scared me a little bit. Luckily, um, yeah, I let the property know and everything, but scared me a little bit. So I was like, what are you trying to do? But I think he meant to go to the other apartment complex, so. Alrighty, here's my nachos. I know they're not super appealing looking because I squished it all up, but they're gonna taste bussin'. Um, I also really don't like cheese, and I know like nachos is like a super important part is like cheese, but I hate cheese. It makes me wanna gag. I hate the consistency. I hate the texture. I hate the taste. I hate the smell. Hate it all. Hate it so much. Um, always have, always will since I was like three years old. So no cheese, but bussin' anyway, so. All right, I finished my dinner, 10 out of 10 dinner. Um, now I'm gonna eat this little slice of banana bread, my last little slice of banana bread that I baked myself. I'm gonna drink some water and I'm gonna do some homework work stuff, some more. Um, so just like emails, answering emails, sending emails, um, posting, stuff like that. So, because fun fact, I have three jobs. I, I am the social media intern for Track and Field News. I am the social media manager for my uh, college's art department. And I run the, I'm the head editor in chief of my camp, my school's art and literature magazine. So yeah, I don't know how I do it. Don't ask me, but I do it, so. Okay, I'm actually, I need to unload the dishes. So that's my next activity of the evening. Here we go. Whiskey's gonna help me. Um, but yeah, I kind of hate doing the dishes, but whatever. And Loki, our freaking dishwasher has been broken. Like we kind of have to run it every twice, every single time because it's not washing anything on the bottom rack. And like we cleaned it out and we usually rinse our dishes. So I don't really know what's happening, um, but we're kind of just hoping for the best and that it goes away eventually. All right, then I get my clothes out for tomorrow. I'm gonna tidy up my room because it's quite dirty. Um, and yeah, that's kind of it, but. These shoes are actually, I love them. Cloud Monster, on on Cloud Monsters. That's what they are, 10 out of 10. Okay, now I'm gonna do my skincare routine. I have to like hunch over like the hunchback in Notre Dame because my freaking sink is so low. Um, <laughs> but here's my skincare routine every single evening. This is the off-brand one, but it's the pink grapefruit exfoliating face scrub. It's cheaper, off-brand oil-free acne moisturizer. I've been using these since like eighth grade and my skin has been relatively decent. So why change it, you know what I'm saying? And then snail mucin. I added this recently because my teammate told me to and I was like, all right, I'll try it. And I tried it and I kind of look like I've been electrocuted, but whatever, still haven't taken my hair out from my run. But I did shower after my bath, so I don't need to shower tonight. I just didn't wash my hair wasn't a hair wash day, so.
think that's kind of it for the day. I'm just going to do a couple more emails and work stuff and homework. Um, and then I think I'm just going to watch TikTok on the couch with whiskey until bedtime. So I hope this was everything you hoped and dreamed it would be. Um, definitely going to like continue to grow and learn. But I'm excited. And honestly, this was really fun. It was like a long version of TikTok. And I'm so excited to hopefully continue to do this. I don't know like what a schedule will be. I'm kind of like a <clears throat> more with like a go with the flow kind of girl. So we'll see um, how often I post. But hopefully like once a week. And you know, day in my life, what I eat in a day, race day, workouts, stuff like that. Um, if you have any ideas, let me know. And yeah, this was really fun. So I apologize for any poor editing skills. You got to give me some slack because I've never done this before. But we're going to grow and learn together. So yay, like and subscribe and we can take this YouTube running journey together.